Twas the night before Christmas, when all through the house, not a creature was stirring, not even a mouse. The stockings were hung by the chimney with care, in hope that St. Nicholas soon would be there. The children were nestled all snug in their beds, while visions of sugar plums danced in their heads. When out on the lawn there arose such a clatter, I sprang from my bed to see what was the matter. Away to the window I flew like a flash, tore open the shutters and threw up the sash. When, what to my wandering eyes should appear, but a miniature sleigh and a tiny reindeer. With a little old driver, so lively and quick, I knew in a moment it must be sent me. More rapid than eagles, his courses they came, and he whistled and shouted and called them by name. Now Dasher, now Dancer, now Prancer and Vixen, on Comet, on Cupid, on Donna and Blitzen. To the top of the forest, to the top of the wall, now dash away, dash away, dash away all. And then in a twinkling, I heard on the roof the prancing and pouring of each little hoof. As I drew in my head, I was turning around, down the chimney, St. Nicholas came with a bound. His eyes, how they twinkled, his dimple, how merry, his cheeks were like roses, his nose like a cherry. His drawn little mouth was drawn up like a bow, and the beard on his chin was as white as the snow. He was chubby and plump, a right jolly old elf, and I laughed when I saw him, in spite of myself. A wink of his eye and a twist of his head soon gave me to know I had nothing to dread. He spoke not a word, but went straight to his work, and filled all the stockings, then turned with a jerk. And leaned a finger aside of his nose, and giving a nod up the chimney he rose. He sprung to his sleigh, to his team gave a whistle, and away they all flew, like the down of thistle. And, and I heard him explain, ere he drove out of sight, Happy Christmas to all!